I humbly come before you, Lord, and I, I beg and I plead that you give me the courage, the wisdom, the words, the will to speak. And I beg the Lord that you give me the words, that you physically put the words in my mouth, that you'll have me speak. I pray in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I am nothing but the dust of the earth. I am nothing, I'm nobody. But I am God's dirt. I uh, want to remind people that if you're in the, the will and grace of Jesus Christ, and if you're pleasing to God, we will be going home soon, very soon. Home. That means a, a lot of different things for a lot of different people. But home. A place that you know. A place that's familiar. A place that you love. A place that you feel safe and secure. A place that you feel loved. A place that you feel unmeasurable love. Unfathomable love. And joy unspeakable. A place you call home. And a place that I call home. This sinful world, the more and more sinful it becomes, the more I realize, and I think the more you realize, that we don't belong here. This just isn't right. But our home is in heaven with our Lord and Savior. Home. A place that place that you know, a place that you feel comfortable in, a place that you feel at peace, secure, a place that, that you know, a place you call home. And the memories of this world will fade away and become nothing but love and joy and peace and happiness, unmeasurable happiness. A peace and a joy and a love that's unmeasurable, unfathomable. So I want you to all stay strong and remember that right now in these last days that what we say and what we do is more important than you could ever imagine. Now is not a time to not be strong in the faith, to not show your faith, to not live your faith, and to never be ashamed of your faith. And that's why the Holy Spirit asked me to carry my Bible everywhere I go and to say the blessing over every meal. I'm, I'm not asking you to say the, 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 uh, say the blessing or to carry your Bible. I'm asking you to pray and to be led by the Holy Spirit. And if the Holy Spirit moves on you like he moved on me, to carry your Bible in public and to say the blessing, I'm sure you will join me and say the blessing and carry your Bible everywhere you go. I buy disposable Bibles and that way I can leave a Bible in doctor's offices and hospital waiting rooms Anywhere I go that I feel that I need to leave a Bible, I will leave a Bible. If I speak to somebody that's that, that I don't know, that I'm like a stranger, and I'm talking to them about Jesus, and I ask if they have a Bible, if they don't have a Bible, I'll ask them if they want, if they want mine. And that's why I carry this type of a Bible. And I pass these Bibles out. If somebody writes to me, or emails me, says they need a Bible, I'll send them a Bible, free of charge. And I pray for you all. I pray that you all come to know the saving grace of Jesus Christ. I pray for you all. Amen.